Style girl, welcome back. Guess who has some summer style inspo for you? Me. So let's go ahead and get right into the video. I am styling up some recent thrifted finds as well as some items that I have in my closet that just so happen to be on trend for summer fashion. The first look happens to be this maxi dress. It is plain black, but when I tell you it packs a good punch, the quality, amazing, superior, you must get a black maxi dress. This maxi dress is definitely one of the items in my closet that gets multiple wears a week. Um, I wear it around the house, I wear it outside, I rent it for errands, you can dress it up, you can just you can do a lot with this black maxi dress. It's like the little black maxi dress. <laughs> I simply styled this dress with some elevated accessories. Let's start with the earrings. I'm wearing a bunch of pearls as earrings and you really don't need a ton of jewelry if you wear an earring style like this. This is the statement piece for the jewelry department. I also styled this dress with a hobo bag. It is a bag that I purchased years ago. It does look like the Bottega knot bag or the Jody or whatever it is. I don't know girl. I don't know. The, the knot bag. That's what it looks like and I love it because it's so spacious and it just kind of like sits on the shoulder comfortably. The color perfect. Um, I need more like this and different colors. My shoes are my dad sandals. I know you guys are tired of seeing these but I'm not tired of wearing them because they're just that shoe that you can literally wear with anything. They're comfortable. However, they do now squeak when I wear them. So I don't know what that's about. I'm gonna have to take it to the Chanel mechanic, but <laughs> they squeak when I wear them. But they just, I couldn't resist pairing them with this maxi dress because it's just such a casual look. The Sunnies are from my small business, the vault label. And I'm pretty sure by the time you're seeing this video, um, they'll be available for you to shop. So I'll be sure to link them down below. They add that main character energy to this look and I appreciate them so much. I've never worn white sunglasses. Well, they're not like stark white. They're more like a cream color, but white. I've never worn white sunglasses as much as I wear these and to be honest, they are what my sunglass collection was missing. On to the next look, we found a thrifted vest, which you can find these vests now at like H&M, Zara, any any high street store sells this vest. However, I just knew I would be able to find it in the thrift store and she did. So we found this and I'm styling it with a skirt skirt kind of like giving tuxedo vibes but with a skirt and I love this I have this cropped tank top that I made into a bandeau I pretty much just tucked it into my strapless bra um, noted that we need bandeaus in the wardrobe um, but yeah, I didn't have one, so I just kind of like got it how I live, you know. I felt like this black look needed a little bit of color, so I added this Ariel's Halo headband. This is more of a pink, like a mustard color, brown and black. It's so pretty. Oh my goodness. I love these. I absolutely love these. It's a black owned business, so if you have not checked them out, I need, I will link it down below. I will link it down below. For my shoes, I opted to pick a slim sandal. We're not doing chunky this time. I just wanted the look to be more refined, less edgy, and a little bit elevated. So I felt like the slenderness of the sandal would look nice with this look. And then to top it off, my bag is new in from Mango. I will link it down below. But it's this uh, top handle bag that has rhinestone detail on it it's pretty simple but it's definitely a standout girly piece that I do recommend you add to your wardrobe I'll link it down below this next look features a longer blazer vest which I absolutely love I'm pretty sure it's a blazer dress but it's too small for me to wear as a dress so I'm wearing it as just a longer vest or like overcoat type situation if that makes any sense. I have it layered on top of a bodysuit that is a hero in my wardrobe. When I tell you I wear this bodysuit out, I have it in multiple colors, I wear it out. And she comes in handy with outfits like this where you don't want to wear too much underneath, you just need something so that you're not out here in your bra if you're not comfortable doing that. Um, in the last video I did speak about summer layering and how it is a thing and it can definitely instantly upgrade or elevate your outfit. The bottoms that I chose to wear are these denim high waist black shorts. 
they are my new favorite because of the length and the comfort um i'm no longer into short shorts uh, they're just uncomfortable for me and i'm getting older and i need to be more refined okay so i want something a little longer in length and these are perfect these work so well with this look to inject a little bit of color i chose my lorve sunglasses that are like this red plum color and then a beaded thrifted bag which is also the same shade as the sunglasses so you know we're we're coordinating over here the next look i think might be my favorite you guys know i have a favorite in this video all the looks it's it's so hard to pick a favorite but i think this one might be the one i have this bathing suit that i bought for vacation a few months back and i was like when i saw it i was like oh this is gonna get wear in more places than just the pool so i could not wait to style it up and i recently picked up these pinstripe trousers oh my goodness these were like a unicorn waiting for me because i've been stalking this suit it comes as a suit i've been stalking it and it's been sold out so when i came across it in the store i was like it was meant for me it was in my size and everything anyways I wanted to pair these two together I just felt like the black the gold the creaminess of the trouser the pinstripe detail I just felt like they meshed so well together and then I wanted to bring it more casual because of the embellishment on the top I chose to wear this outfit with a sneaker instead of like a sandal which I could you can definitely even wear this with a heel if you needed to elevate it a little bit more this outfit is everything to me and then to add the drama these are new sunglasses from the vault label they are called zora they give that mask like look and if you know what i know if you know you know if you know you know these glasses are everything now they're not for everybody but if you love the drama and you're not scared to take risks with your looks these are for you I'm sure I'll have them linked down below. Lastly, to add a little interest and a little texture, I have my puzzle bag, which gets worn time and time again. By far the best, the best luxury handbag purchase I've ever made, ever. Even more than my Chanel flap. Like this bag right here, she gets worn down, all right? Worn out. I'm so proud of her. The last look is centered around this thrifted fine that I cannot believe I found. Well, I could believe it because I'd be finding all the things, but it's a silk scarf that is massive, you guys. It is so big, and I finally get the size scarf that I need to make it into a top or to wear it multiple ways as a top. I cannot tell you how excited I am. I cannot tell you how many ugly frog scarves I had to kiss in order to get this one. So. I styled it with some cargo pants and I want the top to do all the talking because it is a busy print. Um, the color is busy, the, the print is busy, and I want it to be the focal point of this whole entire look. I styled it with my old Celine sunglasses, which I absolutely love and adore, and then that same hobo bag and then just some brown, very casual sandals. This is the look um, and I couldn't be more proud of it. I'm definitely gonna keep this on for the rest of the day because she's that girl. She is that girl. Okay, style girl, that is it for this week's Summer Style Inspo. I hope this was helpful. I hope this inspired you, one, to get to your thrift store and two, to get in your closet and make those outfits. If you need more inspo, like right now, like right after this video ends, I will be sure to put more videos on the end screen for you to watch and enjoy. Until next time, style girl, bye.